Amazon is a huge marketplace with many sellers trying to attract shoppers to their product pages. But once a customer lands on your product detail page, how do you further highlight your brand's value proposition and identity? As a brand registered Amazon seller, you have access to unique tool specifically designed to boost brand awareness and increase sales. Amazon Storefronts Hello everyone, I'm Ankita Patel, product evangelist at SellerApp and today I'll talk about how to create a brand store on Amazon. Here's a quick overview of topics we are covering in this video. Before we begin, if you find this video helpful, click the like button below and subscribe to SellerApp so you don't miss out on more exciting Amazon selling tutorials in the future. And don't forget to follow us on our social media channels. Let's get started. Amazon Store is a powerful feature that empowers the sellers to create their own personalized storefronts within the Amazon marketplace. This self-managed tool allows brands to showcase their products, tell their story and connect with the customers in a more immersive and engaging way. Unlike traditional Amazon listings, which are often lost in the sea of products, Amazon stores stand out as a dedicated brand hub. Best of all, it's completely free to use. That's right, owning an Amazon storefront won't cost you a penny. Now let's take a look at a well-designed and optimized Amazon brand store from Peloton. Peloton sells bikes and fitness gear, so their store is all about movement. The top of their store has a video showing uh, someone enjoying a class and using Peloton equipment at home. Below that, they have clear sections for bikes guide, uh, then the accessories and apparel, each with a clean image you can easily find out what you are looking for. Peloton also uses text on images sparingly and thoughtfully, making it easy to understand. They even have a cool feature where you can click on items in pictures and add them to your cart right there. This makes it easy for shoppers to buy the exact item they want. At the bottom of the store, they answer the technical questions and tell you where to find classes and which devices work with their products. It's a great way to make sure the customers have all the information they need. Amazon stores have been around for a while, but a lot of brands haven't used them much. Yet, if you use them the right way, with the right knowledge and research, you could boost your sales by up to 30% from your storefront alone. An Amazon brand storefront offers several advantages for sellers and brand owners. So here are some of the key perks. Firstly, a storefront allows you to showcase your brand's unique identity and story, enhancing the brand recognition and loyalty among the customers. A well-designed storefront instills trust and credibility, making customers more likely to purchase from a professional-looking brand. You can create an immersive and engaging shopping experience for Amazon shoppers. Customize your store, add multiple pages and organize the products by categories for easy navigation. This is the only real estate on Amazon where your customer's base won't be distracted by ads from other brands. Amazon storefront analytics provide insights into sales, traffic and engagement, allowing you to understand customer behavior and make data-driven decisions to improve your storefront's effectiveness. Storefronts are available only to the brand registered owners and the sellers, giving you an exclusive platform to showcase your products and the brand. You can drive external traffic from the Amazon attribution and advertising an analytic solution that tracks the performance of your non-Amazon marketing channels on the Amazon itself. Share your storefront link on social media, email campaigns or even other advertising channels to direct the traffic and potential customers to your branded shopping experience. Amazon stores optimize the viewing experience for the mobiles and desktops, ensuring a seamless experience across all the devices. 
You can also organize the products into uh, different categories to create cross-selling opportunities, encouraging the customers to explore and purchase multiple products from your brand. Use your Amazon store to run seasonal promotions, showcase limited time offers, new arrivals and best-selling products to boost your online store's overall conversion rates. Moving on to the interesting part, now how to create a brand store on Amazon. To start an Amazon storefront, you firstly need to be a part of the Amazon brand registry program. This program helps protect your brand and products from being copied on Amazon. It provides tools to search for knockoff products and Amazon actively keeps an eye out for copies of your goods. To apply for Amazon brand registry, you need a registered trademark. Amazon accepts the trademarks from the World Intellectual Property Organization and specific countries including the United States, Brazil, Canada, etc. If you are eligible, follow these steps to apply. Sign into your Amazon Seller Central or Vendor Seller Central account. Then provide your brand name, the one with the active registered trademark. Share your government registered trademark number. List the product categories related to your brand. Specify the countries where your brand's products are made and distributed. So after you submit your application, Amazon will review it. They may contact the person associated with the registered trademark to answer some of the questions. Amazon will then decide if your brand meets its requirements for the brand registry program. Also, approval times for uh, Amazon brand registry can vary from 24 hours to over a month. It depends on the specifics of your application. Upon approval, Amazon will send you a verification code. You'll use this code to officially enroll in the brand registry program. Once you have joined the Amazon brand registry program, then it's time to open your very own store on Amazon. So here's how you can do it. Go to your Amazon Seller Central or Amazon Vendor Central account and log in. On the main navigation bar, find and click on the storefront. On the next page, choose the Create Store option. A box will pop up. Pick your brand's name from the list. After choosing your brand, click on Create Store. If you don't see your brand's name in the pop-up, Make sure you have completed uh, the Amazon brand registry process. Only approved brands associated with your account will show up when making an Amazon storefront. Now Amazon will take you to its store builder. Before moving forward, Amazon needs some basic information. Brand display name. Now choose a name that represents your brand this name will appear on your store, so make sure it's something customers will recognize. For example, if your name is Acme Inc., you might use Acme as your display name. Next is brand logo. Upload an image for your brand logo. It should be at least 400 into 400 pixels. Even though you can hide it, having a visible logo is helpful for your audience. Once you have set your brand name and logo, click next to keep building your Amazon store. Now in this step, you'll select a layout for your homepage. Amazon provides pre-designed templates to simplify the process. These templates work similarly to website builders like Wix, allowing you to customize your Amazon store using a drag and drop interface. No coding or development experience is required to create a store although some design experience may be definitely helpful. Your homepage design options include mark, highlight several products using your brand uh, having larger images. Next is product highlight, focus on your best selling products with a bold image or the video. Next is product grid, uh, showcase all your catalog items. Amazon also offers a blank design for businesses with a web design team. Before choosing a home page design, you'll need to add a page meta description. Keep your description concise and simple. Uh, use it as a tagline 
to summarize your business products and how you benefit shoppers on Amazon. Once you're ready, select your preferred template and click save. With your design chosen, it's time to personalize your Amazon store. Amazon's drag and drop storefront builder makes it way easy to uh, tailor your store to your Amazon brand. Now, upon entering the builder, you'll see a series of tiles. Their arrangement depends on the design you have selected. Click on these tiles to customize them with the products, text, videos, or images. If you add a text tile, you can bold, italicize, and align your text. You can also include links within these tiles, directing the customers to a product or a page on your store, such as the product category. In addition to tiles, a preset box uh, at the top of the page allows you to upload a hero image. Choose an image that captures your brand or showcases your best-selling product. The minimum image size is 3000 into 600 pixels. Product are the heart of your Amazon store and you can add them using tiles. Before adding the products to your store, you will need to upload them to your Amazon seller account. You can add the products individually or in the bulk. For a faster experience, upload your products in the bulk. To add products to your Amazon Seller Central account, uh, firstly log into your Seller Central account, select uh, the inventory from the navigation menu, click add a product for a single product or add products via upload for multiple products. Once you have created your product listings, you can add them to your Amazon store. Go to your in-progress Amazon store, click on a tile and select uh, the product search for your product by keyword or the ASIN. Click add to add the selected product to the tile. Adding pages to your Amazon store can definitely help the shoppers navigate your stores easily. With straightforward navigation, customers can find the products they need, increasing the likelihood of placing an order. Therefore, adding pages is worthwhile if you have a large product catalog. For inspiration, consider how Anchor customized their Amazon store with the pages. They organize their store into categories like new releases, deals, and power strips. Anchor even creates sub pages within the pages. For example, their portable chargers page features sub pages like colorful surprises, uh, ultra high capacity specs, and featured innovations. This organization makes it easy for the shoppers to find what they need. To add a page to your Amazon store, click Add Page from the left hand menu in the Store Builder main menu. Add a navigation title for your page. This will appear on your store's navigation bar. Enter a meta description for your page. Uh, this should describe what your page is all about. Select your page template, mark product highlight or product grid. Your new page will appear and you can start customizing it. Before making your Amazon store public, preview it to ensure uh, everything looks and functions as intended. Click preview from the navigation bar uh, located above the store builder to see how your store will appear on the Amazon. You can also interact with your storefront to confirm uh, all the elements such as links work correctly. Consider seeking feedback from others by inviting them to preview and provide their thoughts on your store. Once you have finalized your Amazon store, it's time to launch it. Select submit for publishing. Uh, from the navigation bar, Amazon will then review and approve your Amazon storefront typically within 72 hours. Monitor any alerts or notifications from Amazon to promptly address any issues and get your store live. That's it. You now know how to create an Amazon storefront. Now creating an Amazon storefront is just the first step. Optimizing it for conversions and profitability is crucial. So here are some key strategies to enhance your storefront. Firstly, target customer pain points. 
customers often arrive at your storefront without a clear idea of what they are looking for guide them towards the best solutions by designing your store around their specific needs and pain points for instance an athleisure store could organize products by sport or activity while a dog food company could categorize products based on the dog size or the diet by understanding your customers' problems, you can effectively guide them on their purchasing journey. Second is tell your brand story. Your Amazon storefront serves as more than just a product showcase. It's an opportunity to connect with the consumers on a deeper level. Share your brand story throughout the storefront, highlighting your origins, motivations, and the unique selling points. Remember, Consumers are driven by the emotions and they seek reasons to connect with the brands. Use your content to foster the brand loyalty and encourage the purchases. Third, leverage Amazon ads for enhanced sales. Amazon ads provide a powerful tool to boost the product visibility and drive sales. Now with its advanced ad platform, anyone can create ads on Amazon. However, the effectiveness of these ads depends on the optimization strategies. To create impactful ads, consider these following factors. Identify your ideal customer profile based on the demographics, interests, and the purchase history. Clearly define your advertising objectives, uh, whether it's increasing brand awareness, driving website traffic, or boosting the product sales. Carefully select the ad placements that align with your uh, target audience and campaign goals. For instance, consider the product detail pages, uh, search results, or even related product listings. Craft compelling ad copy and visuals that resonate with your target audience. Highlight the product benefits, unique selling points, and uh, even few special offers. Continuously monitor your ad performance metrics such as uh, the impressions, clicks and conversions to optimize your campaigns and maximize your return on investment. Next is track performance with brand analytics. Once your storefront is approved, you can start using brand analytics to measure its performance. This comprehensive analytics tool provided for free by Amazon is far more accurate than the third party tools and offers insights into top keywords and search terms used by the consumers and competitors. It also reveals your own top converting keywords. Brands can use this information to optimize their storefront product pages and even improve uh, the ad copy. Next is utilize high quality images. Images are crucial for your Amazon storefront, so avoid using low resolution pictures. Ensure all images are there to Amazon's restrictions and size guidelines. Sixth, optimize for mobile while Amazon's website is, you know, mobile responsive, your store might not be. It's advisable to preview your store on various mobile devices and a laptop to check for overlapping images and copy, ensuring everything functions smoothly. Seven, leverage the Q&A section. Amazon offers an underutilized Q&A section. Don't be the one of those brands that neglect it. The Q&A section is an excellent way to showcase your commitment to the customer service and demonstrate your product's expertise. A series of informative answers can significantly boost the conversions and address any concerns that might be holding uh, the customers back. Now that you understand uh, the process of setting up an Amazon storefront, you are all ready to uh, you know, embark on this exciting venture. Operating an Amazon storefront presents a promising opportunity in 2023. It allows you to leverage both built-in marketing features and promote a branded landing page using creative digital marketing strategies. While handling both the tasks, remember that the quality of your products and the customer experience you provide remains paramount to your potential buyers. Therefore, focus on strengthening your online reputation by encouraging the positive reviews. By combining a well-designed storefront with the high-quality products and an exceptional customer service, 
you can effectively capture the attention of Amazon shoppers and establish a thriving presence on this influential platform. Many popular brands have used Seller App to make well-designed Amazon stores. If you are curious and need help, we are always here to support you at support at sellerapp.com. And that's it for this video everyone. Thanks for watching. Your support means a lot to us. It encourages us to bring out more helpful videos like this. If you found this video helpful, please like, share and subscribe to Seller App. Let us know if you guys want us to create detailed seller guides on any specific topics. You can leave your suggestions in the comment section below and we'll definitely create them for you. If you haven't already, click the bell icon so that you will never miss another video. Also, don't forget to follow us on our social media channels for more helpful content. And as always, happy selling!